Hi, my name is Sam Dhanishakiran and welcome to this Database Lessons video series. In this video, we will talk about uh, Oracle procedures. And uh, please note that this is uh, only a fundamental series. I'll be just talking about the overview of the procedures. Okay, so in the previous video, I talked about what is a package um, and now procedure. Procedure is also a programmable unit in Oracle using which you can store codes within Oracle and grant rights to others to execute. The general structure of a procedure is you would have this create or replace command which would enable uh, you to create a procedure or replace a procedure if it is already there like the package command DDL command that we already saw and uh, what type of input it takes. Uh, so there will be a declaration declaration section of like now what type of input it needs and then what it will do with the input given. So in this case, uh, you know, I'm just uh, showing you an example of this HR schema and uh, I chose this procedure had job history. So let's see what it does. It takes this this input and it inserts that input into a row as a row into this table called job history as simply as that. So people can execute this procedure. Uh, generally people execute the procedure by calling a exec uh, hr uh, secure dml or something. So that's the command and then they pass the value right if the procedure requires value. So uh, and uh, people grant access to the procedure to other users. For example, if I want the procedure, I can give access grant execute on uh, HR and job history to whatever user I need or to a role. So then this user would be able to execute this procedure as simple as that. Um, the same thing can be done for uh, packages also. I missed uh, how to, I missed this statement, how to execute package. So just remember, thank you for watching.